Hey guys, what's up? This is Eric Nam, and I don't know about you guys, but I like being early to trends. I don't like being late to the party. Well, unless I'm fashionably late, but when it comes to trends, you gotta be early, right? You wanna be the first early adopter because then you, you know, you're in, you're cool, right? And I wanna let you know about something that's super cool, super happening right now, and it's called Mindset. Now, you've probably heard me talk about Mindset before, but if you haven't checked it out, you need to check it out because everybody's doing it and it's really really it's just the cool place to hang out right so if you don't know what mindset is mindset is an application that we have created here at dive studios um, and it is a platform that has stories from some of your favorite artists their most intimate deep personal stories about life that they've never shared anywhere else including myself and for me i talk about things that i've never shared um I, I can't I can't tell you what it is here because then I, I would be, you know, I can't. It's on mindset. Um, but I want you guys to check it out because we created this so that it was a resource and a place for both artists and fans to connect about topics that are more serious, that are very personal, that are intimate, that can't be and shouldn't be done in a light manner. So if you go into the application, you guys will be able to hear stories. Um, that I think you will be able to relate to, but you will also find, hopefully, encouragement, inspiration, feel uplifted, feel related to. Um, and there's just a lot of great content on there. Now, there's also a great thing called boosters, and boosters are like shorter form things where there's even like a wake me up where I pretend like I'm your coach in life. And it's it's a little embarrassing, but I also had a lot of fun doing it because I just thought it was a fun way to wake people up, you know? Getting up in the morning, if you're a little sleepy, don't worry, I got your back. I'm yelling at you. I'm walking you through some exercises. I'm screaming at you and making you smile. So, you know, we have the emotional, sentimental, real deep um, content. And then we also have the fun stuff, stuff that you can use every day in your daily life. So please check it out. I hope you guys love it. I hope you guys enjoy it. You guys can start listening right now. Just download the app. It's at Get Mindset, G-E-T Mindset, M-I-N-D-S-E-T dot com, or go to the app store and look for Mindset by Dive Studios. And if you can, please leave us a rating and a review. Five stars, because it really does help us. We really put so much into it, and it, it wouldn't be possible without you guys. And we're here to enjoy it and share it with you guys as well. So please check it out. Love you guys. Now back to your show. Welcome us in, Pineo. All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Get Real, hosted by Penela B2B. Ashley. Ashley. BM. After you glare at him, you're like, Jinx. <laughs> <laughs> all right, anyways, uh, yes, Get Real is hosted by us, and uh, we are going to be getting honest about all the ups and downs of young adulthood, but from our perspectives. Our perspectives. Our perspectives, yeah. And today is a host special. Holy Ooh, I feel like we haven't… Have we done just us three in a while? No, it's been a cool right, minute. It's been, it's been a while, right? It's been a while, yes. Yeah. Anyways, we are going to be reflecting on the past 39 and now the 40th <gasps> episode of 40? Get Real. Damn, wow. Damn. I did not know it's been that long. All right. 40 episodes. Oh uh, yes, it's been almost exactly a year since this journey has began. Mm -hmm. And yes, who knew? Uh, meeting each other after all those years… And becoming close friends would lead to a podcast like this. Like the number one podcast in the world. <laughs> yes. Anyway. Number one. <laughs> yes, we've gotten to know each other even more. But hopefully we will learn a little more about ourselves today. Kyo. Anyways, uh, interact with us on our socials at The Dive Studios. Or leave us a comment on our full episode videos at youtube.com slash divepods. Which will, uh, which will be up a few days after the audio release. And once again, subscribe to uh, the podcast on Spotify and Apple Podcasts. And leave a review on Apple Podcasts so more people can know about this awesome show. And join in on the fun. Five stars only. Good comments only. All right. All Damn, right. It's been 40 it's episodes. 40, 40 episodes. Wow. Um, <laughs> yes. No, not 40 weeks because we, we are… I mean, yeah, 40 weeks. I thought you yeah. meant like us. Oh. But… We do like three episodes 
it's a secret. Each time. So not anymore. I'm wearing the yeah. same clothes in every single video. Yeah, same here. <gasps> Is that what you're doing now? Now that we've reached 40 episodes? I've been just... doing this. Yeah, he was, uh, he was doing that like episode 20. I just started today. <laughs> oh, well, technically two episodes ago. Yeah. Because you're changing. So it's like, oh, okay. They know. Yeah, but it's okay. I, I like it. I you like changing. It. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Anyways, um, what is there to talk about? How Congrats do you think our podcast us. is doing? Um, great. That's great. I mean, we have uh we've had a couple of ads come in. Yeah. Yo. Yo. We're making a little bit of extra mula mula. A little bit of extra um, mula on the side side. I'm sure I feel like we have a big listening base. Do we have a like a number of like how many people are listening? Half Ooh. a million. Half a milli. Half a milli. We have that just intimidated me just now. Yeah. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Just thinking like half a million people are, people are you. listening. Why? Well, you have like three hundred something plus followers that are watching you. Yeah, it's different though. Why is it? Why, why is it different? Why is it different? It's just a little. You different. discriminating? No. You looking down on podcasts? No. I don't know. Because Instagram is just pictures. Uh, so you don't… Because you don't talk. And here mm. I'm talking for like an hour. Yeah. More personality yeah. on a show I guess. Mm. For sure. Well, oh, we there's... killing the game right now. If y'all don't know about Get Real yet… Get familiar. You have 39 shows yeah. to catch up on. Yeah. If, you, if you're cool then you know about Get Real. What was your favorite episode? Or favorite topic I guess I should say. Or, or remember… Something that kind of… I feel Stuck like we, your head. we have a lot of good moments with uh, PH1. PH1. Uh, one one par- particular episode that I really felt good about was um, huh. Sogum's. Sogum's. Sogum. I wasn't here Sogum for that. Was here. She's a very deep person. I feel like the episode with her was very… Um, it was for people… People can feel very warm listening to it. I feel like. Oh, that's good. That's good. Yeah. That's good she that's she good. got like deep on like… Inner soul type stuff. Like Ooh. being a beautiful soul. Just right, like, right. Inner peace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And just like, you know, embracing your ugly and making that mm. look beautiful. Because that's you in the end. Yeah. All right. I okay. really like that episode. I like right. PH1's little hairy situations. Mm-hmm. Those are always fun. Um, Yeah, there's a lot of good moments. We had right. a lot of great guests on the show. Yeah, yeah made for the sure. show yeah. even more fun. Who was your favorite guest? <laughs> My favorite? I'm just, I'm just kidding. <laughs> don't answer that. Don't answer okay, that. Don't yeah. answer that. Oh, I mean, I feel like you're going to be biased and say Joan was your favorite guest anyways. Yeah. Because that's like, we're all my favorite. <laughs> that's your best friend. Yeah. That was, they were all my okay. favorite. Any like remembering… What's it called? Remembering? Insan ki What is that? Memorable. Uh, memorable. There we go. Ah, uh, my, my English is getting worse and worse and worse. And any memorable topics? I mean, you kind of answered, I guess. Like mm. the inner peace. Like, yeah, English that was ugly. dope. Do you have any rem- like memorable topics that we talked about? Um, when we talked about family, mm. uh, I don't think Peniel was here. For oh that, yeah, right? that was also a PH one episode. Yeah, we mm. were like leaving. I missed all the best episodes. Damn, <laughs> you all missed right. out on a few. You were busy. Damn. It's okay. What What did you guys think when you guys were presented this idea of having a podcast? So when Dai reached out, I think it was originally supposed to be like a different format. It was supposed to be like me and two other girls. But then um, I didn't know who the other two people were. Oh, and the? then… Yeah, you guys were second choice. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, it was hell. no, it was so it was <laughs> Hey, you wanna start a new podcast with me, bro? I think we <laughs> I think we were supposed to be on different podcasts because what I heard was like two two. I don't know. Yeah, that oh. was a long time oh, yeah, ago. Yeah, yeah, I don't even remember. But I loved it because it was like Matthew and with Peniel, you know, yeah. with two friends. But then I didn't know where this was gonna go because I was like, what will we talk about for an hour? Just like, you know, we don't, because we're new to adulting too and we haven't really lived our lives because um, yeah. we're so in, yeah. we're so like restricted in the K pop world or yeah, whatever. That's true. And I want, I worried if it was going to be interesting enough, but um, I think also COVID. 19 had a lot to do with it because a lot of people spent more time at home. So sure. they were listening more. And ever since then, I've been getting so many messages saying how um, we're like helping them and mm, yeah, they really yeah. enjoy the show. And whenever yeah. I get comments like that, I'm really glad that we started it. Well, when did you first hear about it? Or yeah, I, out or like, what, what happened? When I, I don't exactly remember. I just remember, do you want to be on a podcast? And I was just like, I'm down. <laughs> <laughs> Very simple. I mean, huh? I mean, another thing is I didn't know anything about podcasts. The only podcast I ever watched or like 
saw clips of was Joe uh, Rogan. Joe Rogan. Joe, yeah. And I was just like, yeah, right. all right, do I have to, like, he's so intellectual. Yeah, dude, he's like, so smart. Yeah, so I was just like, do I need to start studying before I start this? And then, yeah, I, I did. I was like a little intimidated by that too. I was yeah. like, dude, like, we're going to host our podcast. Mm-hmm. Like, I've been on as a guest for a few, but I was like, do I have to start studying again? Yeah. Like, I don't remember that. Uh, yeah, because I remember in, when Dai first reached out to me, I think it was supposed to be us two and then you and then another girl, I think. Oh. I think there was supposed to be four. Yeah. yeah. And then it was kind of supposed to be like guys' perspective and then mm. girls' perspective, yeah, yeah, I yeah. think. Yeah. On certain like situations, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Um, was it? Wasn't it right? In the beginning, right? It was supposed to be like that, right? Yeah. But So how would you feel if there was another girl here? I would, I would, I would like it, mm. but <laughs> no? it depends on who it is. Ah, you true, know? true, true. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, like it if it was like if it was Joan, you would love it. Yeah, Who's like, she has her own podcast yeah, right now though. Not, not the, yeah. Who's like your worst arch enemy? An arch enemy. What? what? Out of arch, who? arch nemesis enemy? An enemy in general? <laughs> yeah. I don't have. Don't lie. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't have one thinking? that she can talk about on the podcast. <laughs> ah, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> no, I really don't. I'll ask you later. And personally, mm-hmm. I'll let you know, Diane. Okay. We'll call her and get her on the show. Right. That's gonna. But be you're probably stuff. not gonna like that person either. Then. Oh really? Yeah. Did you guys ever lie on the podcast? On the podcast? Mm-hmm. I don't think so. Did Did we ever lie? Did you lie? Yes. About, about what? what? I think there was one episode where I said Ashley was cool. <laughs> <laughs> I lied. <You're> so annoying. <laughs> what? Did you lie? I feel like you lied. That's why you brought it up. No, I never lied. I just I just couldn't talk about something, so I just like brushed it off. I mean, what could oh. it be a talk about? You said your you said your junior high thing went to jail. Oh, juvie, I mean, that's juvie, 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 yeah. juvie. Hmm. I what definitely brushed off a lot of things. <laughs> I couldn't say. Yeah, just so you guys know, we're still in in the in the industry, so. so we can't get real a hundred percent. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> like ninety nine percent. Yeah, yeah, maybe like in ninety. 80, but it, but if you stick around. <laughs> Maybe we might yeah, give you maybe, little pieces yeah. here. Maybe later maybe on. Like I the don't 80th know. episode or Just something. Know, Just saying. Know. Yeah. There might be some hot who topics knows. coming mm-hmm. in soon. Maybe. <laughs> maybe. I think one thing this podcast has done is put into perspective how much I like moderating. Mm. I like I like having people come in and for whatever the topic is, making sure they feel like the man or woman or mm-hmm. just comfortable you know what I mean yeah, 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 just yeah. talking about like whatever the craziest shit to like real life problems yeah you're really good at that I making know. people feel comfortable mm, thanks. for sure for sure mm. thanks I still lied about you being cool <laughs> 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 you, you hit like the hardest bone of mine <laughs> <laughs> that was stupid he literally like punched his kneecap <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't know about me personally, but I do like I do get a lot of mentions where people said like, "Oh, like some of the uh, mail time stuff, like mm-hmm. they're struggling with similar stuff, and the uh, and that um are um oh <laughs> you can cut that out. Our our um what do you call it? Our opinions are shoot our thoughts. Is it thoughts? Is that what I'm thinking of? Are you? Do you have a Korean word? I don't know. I I'm, I'm lost for both words right now. Our, Anyways, our um, space. I don't know. Our words, our thoughts, help them out a lot. Yeah. Um. All right. Our advice. advice. That's what I was looking for. Advice. <laughs> yes. Our advice helped them out <laughs> He's a lot. Like I beat you, Diane. Yeah. <laughs> I, I thought of my own word I in my own. Thought of it all by myself. <laughs> I'm a big man now. Oh, by the way, if uh, you guys are having problems looking for words, Grammarly is also an <laughs> ad that uh, um, sponsors us. So check out Grammarly. Grammarly. Damn, I thought you had like a serious announcement. For <laughs> like, oh, yo, by the way, I was like, oh, shit, what is it? But yeah, uh, I, I see a lot of those mentions from time to time. So I think that's super cool. Because uh, honestly, I didn't really know what to think about like coming into the podcast. Mm. Because I'm very new to podcasts too. Um, I, like I said, I've like guested on a few. But I haven't really been the host. 
Um, and I was just kind of like, dang, like, what are we going to talk about? Like, you know, it's like, I feel like it's so limited what we could talk about because we're in the entertainment industry. You know, we do have to filter. I'm like, damn, like, can we do a good job? Like, blah, blah, blah. And I remember, um, I would like, I would see a few podcasts. I wouldn't really listen though. Mm-hmm. I was more of a visual person. I needed like a video with it. So I was like, dang, damn. I wonder um, if it'll work out. I hope it works out. But I think we've been doing pretty good. Yeah, I mean, shoot, yeah. half a milli uh, listeners a month. Yeah. Is that on a good month or like a bad month? <laughs> That's an okay no, month. So you're like saying a average, good so month okay. could go up to like maybe like 700. 600, 700. Oh. We're killing okay, the okay, game right okay. now. How much does Joe Rogan get? Uh, like millions. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay. Like, okay. yeah. Millions and millions. Let's hope to reach that far. Okay, okay, yes, yes. yes. We need to be smarter. Yeah, I didn't really know what to expect though in the beginning. No. Mm. Um, and I remember our first pilot episode or whatever too. Oh my god, at that was, other office. Yeah, the other office, the other studio. Mm-hmm. It was summer then too, because I remember we came in like shorts and everything. Yeah. Oh yeah, um, yeah, yeah. It was, it was like hot. May. And we sucked. I mean, I feel like we still kind of suck. We can't <laughs> keep a full conversation for more than like five minutes without a script. We can't. Um, oh, you know what's crazy? We have a script and we keep going off tangent. <laughs> That's true yeah, too. Yeah, we do. But we have no script this time. It's like nothing. It's literally free flow. So I feel like we still kind of suck. Mm. But we sucked even more back then. Because yeah. I remember we had to come in and reshoot a few episodes. Mm. Yeah. Um, but oh. you don't no. remember that? We did? Yeah. yeah. Oh, but they might have used. Oh no, I think they did use the original one because I think like our reactions and everything was like better or something. Mm. But yeah. Um. So it wasn't our talking. It was our reactions that were better, not our talking. <laughs> it was <our> reactions. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for the interruption. Real quick, we wish to thank our sponsor for this episode, which is Grammarly. It's basically an online tool that helps you become a better writer and therefore better communicator. Okay, remember in the first episode we did where Joan guested and I got called out for not always responding right away to business emails because guess what? I'm busy living my life. And also sometimes it's just so much pressure to have to deal with all that kind of stuff by myself because what if I accidentally say something wrong? Or what if I accidentally agreed to something I didn't mean to? Like I already hated writing essays in school so things like this aren't the most fun obviously. But there's no way around it. I'm always going to need to write. Whether it's those business emails or the descriptions for my YouTube videos. And luckily, Grammarly let us test out their service where they do more than just check for spelling or grammar mistakes. They make sure that what I'm writing is done in the most effective and clear way possible. You know how sometimes you'll ask a friend if a risky test or an Instagram caption sounds okay? This is kind of that, but Grammarly probably won't get annoyed with being asked so much like maybe a friend would. Grammarly's premium service even offers real-time guidance that checks everything from tone, word choice, and clarity with suggestions on improving your writing. Using it makes me even aware when I'm speaking out loud whether or not I'm communicating effectively. Like it even reminds me of words that I might have forgotten because of tools like their vocabulary options thing. And like I said, I hated writing essays in school. I just wanted to go out and hang out with my friends or watch K-pop music videos. I'm sure some of you relate to this. So check out if Grammarly can help you get stuff like schoolwork done faster because they even have a tool that makes sure nothing in your work can be considered plagiarized. That's just good peace of mind, you know? Because there's only so many different ways you can say William Shakespeare wrote Romeo and Juliet from the top of your head. Lucky for us internet lovers, Grammarly is available on every platform with their desktop editor, browser plugin, and mobile apps. Do more than just spell check. Say what you really mean with Grammarly Premium. Elevate your writing with 20% off Grammarly Premium by signing up at Grammarly.com slash get real. That's 20% off Grammarly Premium at G-R-A-M-M-A-R-L-Y dot com slash get real. Wait, yeah. so I mean, I, I guess we could talk about how things have changed. Since um, the beginning? Yeah. And mm. like, we got a new studio. I mean, like in our lives. Oh, yeah. Oh, in our lives. <laughs> I know that. <laughs> Maybe like a little update since we don't yeah. really talk about that like, kind of stuff. Peniel, he's been doing Kingdom these days. Oh yeah. Um. 
Yeah, these days uh, we do radio too. So, because two of my members are in the army right now, uh-huh. mm. they come out like end of the year. So right now it's just the four of us. Uh, we do radio every Monday too, and then right now we're getting we're just doing Kingdom. Like mm. you guys are the DJs at the radio, or you guys are guests? Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's like our show. Oh. Yeah, and then um, we are doing Kingdom, which is um, it's very new because it's we. have it's 10 years since our debut. Yeah. But… We guys have run like a… The, we've like never a, done a survival show. So it's like… You guys I'm are like, the what? senior seniors there. Super seniors. Yeah dude. The the youngest member on the show. And… Uh, Eun Gwang Yang and Min Yang. Uh-huh. They're the oldest on the show yeah. right? Their age difference is… I think it was uh, 11 years. Oh, it's wow. an 11 year age difference. Ooh. The youngest… I think the youngest member was on Stray Kids. Uh huh. Like yeah, 2001. And then, yeah. And then I was like, oh dang. And That's then some of the groups like… I remember they're like… Yeah, he's like our oldest member. And I was like, oh how old is he? Like 94. And I was like, damn. That's still younger than me though. I was like, <laughs> yeah, the f-? I was like, dang. How long is this going on for? I think… It starts airing in April. Mm. We started shooting like end of February though. But… It's not like every single day we're shooting. It's like… Because uh, yeah. they give us time to prepare the stage. And when we do it, we prepare the stage. We shoot. Um, and I think… Yeah, it actually starts airing in April. And then it's all pre-recorded shows. And then I think the last stage is live. live? Oh wow. Yeah. That's gonna be… So, um, it's your first com- competition show, right? Like, Yeah. Ooh. We've never done anything else. But I didn't know that they shot for so long. Mm-hmm. I was dying, dude. I was like… They're asking questions. I was like, I'm really sorry. Can you repeat that one more time? I totally blanked out. And it's… Um, yeah, I got home at 8 a.m. the other day. Dang. 7 a.m. Yo, are there interactions between groups? No, they don't let us interact with them. Oh, okay. Really? Yeah, because I from know… What? I know uh, Chris uh, mm-hmm. from… Or Chani. Chani from Stray Kids. Because we mm-hmm. practice together. So I was like, oh, can I go say hi? They're like, no, you can't go see them. I was like, what? They think you're gonna like spoil something. Yeah, something. They think oh. we're gonna like, hey, what stage are you doing? Like, oh, uh, you doing that song? I was like, oh, we're doing this song. It's like, you know. Okay. Uh, I think that's what they're scared of. Uh-huh. Um, so, because they want us to have like genuine reactions too when we see their stage. It's like, oh, right, they're right, doing right. this song. Mm-hmm. It's like, oh, dang. Like, so it's like… <laughs> I was like, I already knew they were gonna do that. Yeah, you guys like, so… It's like, it's like, what song do you guys think they're gonna do? They're gonna do this song. I heard from him. Yeah. It's like, <laughs> so it's like, it's not gonna be fun, you know. So, um… Yeah, I was like, oh, can I go say hi to him? They're like, no, 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 no. I was oh. like, what? Because yeah. I saw Chani when he was a baby. Ah. He literally like, came up to like my like waist bone. Dang. <laughs> what? He was like tiny. He was tiny and like a little chubby. Uh-huh. And now he's… Is he tall? He's a man. He's a man. <laughs> he's a grown uh, he's, he's, not, he's not like super tall. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but he's taller than before. Yeah. And he's like kind of like yeah, cutting he's, everything. He's, he's built now. now. He's pretty like, built. I remember I saw him like on a skateboard and I was like, is that what the f- happened to him? I was yeah. like, where'd all your baby fat go? But yeah, he's he grew up. He a man now. <laughs> <laughs> um, are you preparing for your solo? Yup. When is it coming out? <laughs> There's a lot of stuff. It going might on. be out before the, oh no, maybe like no, around no. the same time. Um, it's probably gonna be out a little bit later. So, a little later. Okay. So we're hoping for late April, early early May. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, um, later then. Yeah, this whole process of getting ready for it has been crazy because the company, my label, has been kind of uh, more trusting and more um, on the side where they're almost relying on me to organize everything. Mm. Mm. So I've been going out doing doing the songwriting, getting the songs. Um, you know, getting meeting all the demos, meeting up with the producers, writing the songs together. Um, <clears throat> some some of the songs participating in the mixing too. Um, obviously, recording all of them. Mm. And um, not only that, I, I you know I I was uh, I want to be as hands on as possible. So I um, I I uh, how do you say sabe? You sabe? You scout? Yeah, you. I scout. I scouted the music video director. Oh yeah. I mean uh, you, you you reached out to him yeah, personally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I found a I found a dope music video director. I'm talking to, you know, the my choreographers that I've been working with for a while. Mm. Um That's good. They give you like creative freedom. Yeah, creative freedom. But the thing with creative uh, the thing with um 
another another big thing I realized with this is you uh. need a team. Mm. Like this oh, whole yeah, process, dude. if you're gonna do it yourself, it's gonna you the legwork first first and foremost is insane. You have to you have to go every like I think taxi money just this past month has been over like 200, 300 bucks. Damn. Yeah, just like going to eat tail one back, going to the gym back, going to the company back, and then just like the amount of time I spend on the phone too is Wait, like but you have ridiculous. A well, I don't. I don't ask him to take me to the the studio in in my homie's studio, like you know, ten at night. Mm. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. My co- my label doesn't work like that. I don't mm. ask my manager to like you know like take me around everywhere. I kind of like just kind of being like my own thing. Yeah, me too. Me too. Yeah. Um, but yeah, like trying to figure out music video concept, talking to my stylist about what I'm gonna wear. Looking on, you know, like searching stuff on on what I should wear and like what I want yeah. things to look like. Just it's like so much work. Mm. But I like where I like where everything's going right now. I like the energy of the team where it's headed right now. And I'm just hoping like <clears throat> the the first solo project that it pops off to a degree where everyone's gonna want to work in this team again. Because mm. I have some dope people on the team right now. But that's good. That's good. You need a team, like yeah, for sure. Yeah. It's 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 like too much stuff to do by yourself. Yeah, so, yeah. Even organizing all that by yourself mm. is crazy. And I think this is a, a good experience for me because at the end of the day, I I have to I have to kind of draw. The, I, I don't want anyone to blame at the end of the day. Mm. You know what I mean, I don't want to be like, oh, you weren't, we weren't on the same page. That's why this flopped. Right, right, that. right. We were. Right. You know what I mean? At the end of the day, I want everything to be like, either damn, BM, BM's idea was tight or BM's idea was whack. And then mm. from there, I got no one else to blame. So I just try a new thing. Right, right, switch right, it up. Right. Build from there. Yeah. Build from there. Yeah. But it's a, it's a good experience. I mean, in the midst of all this, I have a lot of featuring um, love calls coming in. Ooh. Uh, I've been working with some other dope artists. Um, yeah. Just a That's bunch good. of like… That's good. New stuff going on. Busy, busy. Trying, bro. Trying to like rebrand myself for this year. And, you know, obviously… Card um, being that one of our members are in the military right now, right. we're not gonna be able to do stuff until he's out mm. again. But um, yeah, as far as right now, just trying to brand myself as some dope. Better busy than super free. Yeah, super like. free is kind of stressful for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What, what about, about you? you? <sighs> <laughs> oh <my God>. <laughs> <laughs> um, still doing radio, uh, mm-hmm. hosting the radio show. Also doing a Korean radio show oh. for the first time. That's at, like 6 in the morning or something. Yeah, it's at 7 in the morning. Oh, um, and it's with Chang Song gyu But I learn a lot um, doing the show with him. Yeah. So it's good. And it's only like 5 minutes a day. Oh. Yeah. What? Yeah. The corner is like 5-6 minutes. I just teach him one English phrase every single day. So you go 7 a.m.? Oh no, I only five go minutes? once a week. Oh yeah, and okay. pre-record the rest of the days because I can't go every single day for five weeks. Question. I mean, five days. Yes. What have you taught him so far? I I've taught him like sixty phrases so far. Yeah. I've been doing because it's every day, and I've been doing it since like November. Uh-huh. So, oh. it's been super easy stuff. Like, um, what's up, bitches? <laughs> <laughs> no. He's gonna go to America and be like, oh, oh, hold on, hold on. What's, what's up, up bitches? <laughs> <laughs> I think the favorite phrase that he learned was hang in there. Because you know how there. Koreans we use fighting, but we uh, don't say fighting in English, right? right. right? So yeah. like fighting um, is like what? Yeah. What? You want to fight? <laughs> Down I, with me? I taught him hang in there and he uses that the most. He loves that one. Uh, um, I I don't know, just r- words related to corona and everything. And a lot of listeners send in what they want to learn. So mm, I would teach okay. that too. Makes sense. But, but you so you're in the studio for only five minutes a day, technically. Yeah, like five six minutes a day. How much you get paid Dang. for those five six minutes a day? I Can you surprisingly that get no. I can't say exactly how much, but oh, they pay you well. Considering the time, the amount, I only do five minutes. It's a lot. So how much do you make a minute? <laughs> I don't know. So, I'm just saying, considering that it's five minutes, it's pretty good. Yeah. It's okay. Good. Okay. Yeah. So, it's enough to like buy food and stuff. Yeah, on the side. Totally. Yeah. 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 So mm. do you need another host? <laughs> if I ever R2? have to leave, I'll tell you. Or two. Or two. Or two. Can you wake up at 5 30 a.m. though? Actually, you probably yeah. can. Well, you do that during your schedule. Do you no, I can do that. And Peniel doesn't sleep. Yeah, I'll sleep anyways. after oh, yeah, I do yeah, the radio yeah. show. That works. Yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right. What's the company name? 
What do you mean company name? Like, it's like KBS. Oh, it's at MBS. NBC. MB- you, said, you almost said MBS. Because <laughs> you said KBS. <laughs> you almost said MBS. MBC. And I got a new gig. Um, and I'm doing this live stream every Saturday where I interview different guests. It's for like a shopping mall company brand based huh. in like… Southeast Asian countries, Whoa. and they like broadcast live for an hour every Saturday. Whoa! So is it kind of yeah. like home shopping then? Like no, not Korea, home shopping. Know, like it's that, just like, no, oh, you no. don't sell anything. Oh, it's just okay. they're trying to get their name out there by inviting different artists and just like playing games and like having them perform. Mm. Uh-huh. So we're having like Luna, like CIX, and Gravity, oh, nice. and like wow, um, the, yeah, haha, and stuff. So wow, yeah, that's. Hey everyone, this episode is brought to you by our sponsor at BetterHelp. If you've been listening to our podcast for a while, you're probably already familiar with them and that they've been supporting our show for a while. It kind of makes sense because we really do talk about some real stuff and in being so honest, we can really be vulnerable about our feelings. I've told you guys about how when I had my first panic attack and that was one of the scariest but eye-opening experiences of my life. It made me realize just how bad my mental health had gotten and that I really needed to step back and assess what I could do to get back to a stronger state of mind. And obviously that's easier said than done. If you've been struggling, just know we're all here with you and you're for sure not alone. With that said, BetterHelp is a service where they match people to a licensed therapist that is specialized to do their specific needs. They have counselors that specialize in anxiety, stress, and even anger. That's just some on the list. It's not a crisis hotline or a self-help center. It's a platform for professional counseling done specifically online since the most traditional therapy is done in person where you have to make an appointment and could be pretty expensive depending on where you live, your personal situation, and how often you would need to do sessions. I know y'all are hustling and you don't always have time for all of that, so maybe BetterHelp can make it that much easier for you. Check it out one time for yourself. I want you to start living a happier life today and as a listener, you'll get 10% off of your first month by visiting our sponsor at betterhelp.com slash getreal10. Join over 1 million people who have taken charge of their mental health. Again, that's betterhelp, H-E-L-P dot com slash getreal10. Thanks. It's cool. Man, you killing the radio yeah, yeah. scene right Busy. now. It's not You're getting busy. a lot of. I mean, like, as a host. I think this is all possible because I speak English. Yeah. Yeah. Because that that thing too. Because I need to speak with the people in the Southeast Asian mm. countries. I need to be able to speak Korean and English. Right, right, right. And these days, I've been super grateful that you know I do know a second language. Because mm. if without that, there's not much work that I'll be able to do right now. So yeah, thank goodness. I'm sure you're surprised of how much calls are coming in because of that. Yeah. I'd be surprised. I'd be like, damn. So learn a second language, guys. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. That's crazy though. I didn't know you were that busy. No wonder. All right, guys. I yeah. feel like we're all working very hard. <laughs> and there's, I feel like we're nothing, doing very well all right. in life. Let's go into mail time. Already? Okay, well, yes, let's let's uh, let's go to a mail time then. Mm. And we actually asked each host to come up with a special question to ask the other two hosts as a special little treat. Yes, we have. So yes, this is Ashley's question. Oh shoot, sorry. Don't <laughs> <laughs> that hard. Oh shoot, sorry. <laughs> if you had to choose, I mean, I said that too. I meant to. I, See, mine's not even on here. Yeah, why? I sent it late. Too late. Oh. I sent it this morning. <laughs> Not even morning, like this afternoon. <laughs> Anyways. Oh shoot, sorry. If you had to choose me or the other person to co-host with, who would you choose? Is that too mean? Lol, lol, lol. <laughs> That's a question for us, right? Yeah. You want to yeah. answer at the same time? One, two, three. You. you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you assholes! <laughs> I hate you. Is that too mean? <laughs> I'm, so, I'm having too much fun roasting you, actually. Okay, okay well, who would it. you choose? Hmm? Who would you choose? It's not, it's not a question for me. It's a question. Oh, that's for my you question guys, so. for you. No, what's yeah. your question? That was my question. If you had to Don't choose lie. me or BM, who would you choose? Don't lie. Oh, yeah. Was it really? What was his question? 
What was Benil's question? Yeah, Benil's question isn't on here. Yeah, yeah well, you don't BM's, need to have one. BM's question okay. was similar. Yeah, Who okay. would you replace each other with? <laughs> LOL. Why? Huh? LMAO. No, no one, one doesn't, doesn't fly, fly for an, an answer. answer. Start, Start that, that drama, drama and, then and then end the show. <laughs> <laughs> Who would you replace instigator. each other with? So Who would I replace both of you guys with? No, like each other. Like just you two. Oh, oh just oh. you two. Oh, so many people. <laughs> Let's see. Um, no. <laughs> off the top of my head. Wait, so still, many with people. you still here? Hmm? With you still here? Or you gone? Oh, uh, well, I mean that doesn't even matter. It's just… It's between… Hey, don't bring me into the drama. That's your guys' <laughs> drama. <laughs> bring him. Do it. Bring him into no, the no, drama, no, 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 no. Start it. Vroom. Uh, vroom, vroom, vroom. <laughs> Start the drama. <laughs> Who would I replace Pinyol with? And I have to? Mm. I broke my ankle. I'm you know, out for the game, coach. You know, when I sent this question… <laughs> on the bench, you're gonna… When I sent this question, in yeah. my head, I uh-huh. only thought to the part where I laughed that they hear, hear the question. But yeah. like, now that they really have to answer it, I'm just like, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Look what you did. Look what you did. Damn, that's hard. Who, who would you started. replace me with? I want to replace you. I would I would quit the show. What are you talking about, Ashley? Yeah, that's messed up, Ashley. Damn, you're <laughs> gonna replace me? That's messed up. Dude, that's that's why I would pick f- him. <laughs> <laughs> you got no loyalty. <laughs> Damn. No. You're digging your own grave right now, Ashley. <laughs> Damn, I would have been like, what three or none? What the f-? Yeah, I would say that too. You what I'm pretty sure you're like, oh, so many people. <laughs> I was just getting back at you because you were making fun of me. So why are you holding in your laughter? <laughs> I don't know. I'm when did I make so fun of you? Fun. Okay, well. I would I would get another girl. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like who? Um, Leah was fun. Mm-hmm. I would say Joan, but she has her own show now. She could do two. <laughs> Is that allowed? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. What was Peniel's question? Peniel's question. Ah, oh, sorry. I meant to send before I slept last night. Yeah. First impressions! Exclamation mark. LOL. Yeah. First impressions like when we first met or… Yeah, yeah. Not, not, not the… Didn't we thing. talk about this? Like our first impressions ever of each other? Did we talk about it? I don't remember. We just met… We talked about the first time we all met each other. Yeah, I don't mm. think we talked about like first impression of each other though. <gasps> I thought you were mean as hell. Why? <laughs> nah, because you just look mean. Oh, no, I mean… because But every time I meet a sambae or like someone that debuted already… I'm just like… Shoot. They're already in the game. Like I'm not even in the game yet. They're already in the game. So it's like… Ah. Did I meet you before you debuted? Oh yeah, you yeah. did. I yeah, because yeah, I, I met him through you and he didn't yeah. debut then either. Yeah. You just looked super America Americanized to me when I first <laughs> like met super you. Super America. Because <laughs> you were wearing like those really oversized jerseys. Yeah. Um, so I was oh, like, oh yeah, God, he man. is from the States. Oh like, oh he he's cute for sure. Yeah. And I felt like you were very closed off. Really? When I first met you. But I think looking back now, it's because you were going through a really tough time back then. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. That's when yeah. you were going… You kind of had like a depression like during your <laughs> Did I have training? depression vibes? <laughs> like damn you know, like I look depressed. <laughs> <laughs> no you were telling me though. Like, you know, oh yeah 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 yeah. Yeah you were struggling. I did, I did. Oh, uh, fine, maybe fine. that's why I got those vibes. And well, I mean if he said it then yeah. I'm sure you got those vibes. No even before, <laughs> even before he said it. Oh okay okay. Uh, okay okay. okay. Um, Peniel I saw you at Cube like on the staircase. Was I saw you at the first, restaurant. That's That was when we first met? I mean we didn't like me like hi how are you but oh, it was oh, like saw you I saw, yeah. yes you were wearing the hanyang university bomber jacket um oh, yeah you went to hanyang? and you had really yeah, long side day. swept orange hair orange it was like dyed it was I like had brown orange hair yeah you had brown hair oh i did yeah i did i did i did, I did. <laughs> you had hair <laughs> but yeah what is that <laughs> <laughs> you had a lot yeah it was yeah. very long um yeah, I just saw you in the corner of my eyes, like eating in the table next door the, and the, next to the, us. The basement restaurant. Mm-hmm. And I don't know. I just you kind of look like, I don't know, just an average boy. That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. I mean, when I saw, I was like, oh damn, she's definitely going to debut. She looks like a celebrity. That was what? my thought. No way. <laughs> yeah, that's messed up, bro. That's messed up. He gave you a compliment, bro. He gave you a compliment. He's just putting. <laughs> Average as in you didn't look like a celebrity. Yeah, you didn't think that. No, um, I won't say who, Mm -hmm. but one of the trainees was like, "Oh, I heard, I heard like she speaks English, Mm -hmm. and they thought you were cute." Mm -hmm. 
And I was like, Ooh. and then I was like, really? She looks mean. <laughs> 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 I was like, she looks so cold. Oh my god. She looks mean. Yeah. But I think another big thing was your members mm-hmm. looked like they respected you. Plus, there was a little bit of fear. Too. A little bit of fear. <laughs> Dang, they fear her. Wow. Yeah. Really? You better fear like, me too. You beat now. Oh. I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> it's like no, you know, you're a marshmallow. What? <laughs> uh. Yeah, and BM. My first impression was it was your birthday party and like that the Kyungye or whatever in the basement. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dang, that was a while ago. Yeah, yeah. I was just I, I was like, holy, shit, this guy's tall. What the? F-? Yeah. <laughs> and then you were like, yeah, like he's like a trainee. Blah blah. blah. I was like, oh shoot, all right, all right. And then I oh, thought, dang. I thought, I thought. I was like in my head, I was like, they're probably making like a 2 p.m. kind of group or oh, something. Because I was, like, Cause I was big. Big. Yeah. I was like, dang. Yeah. And then I come out with a coin, you're like, what the? <laughs> and I was like, oh, oh, that, oh. Mm. <laughs> but yeah, and then, but I just remember he was like, um, it felt like it kind of like, I feel like he was like awkward though. Yeah. But I, I think I maybe was... that's because you knew I debuted already too, maybe. I don't know. No, no. That day, it was just, there were so many people I didn't know. So oh, it was is that just what? like, okay. that, yeah. It felt like… It kind of felt like an introvert like trying to be extroverted. Mm. Like. Yeah. yeah. No. That was around the times where I was just like… With the people I'm comfortable with, I'm, uh. I'm cool. But like… In those type of scenes, all I knew was you and like five out of like 30 people that were there. Yeah. I didn't know anyone there yeah. either too. So I was just like clicked up with my own squad. Just. And then I just… You kept doing like the awkward laugh like… <laughs> 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 That's all I remember. It's like… Oh, I like to say, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. yeah, it must have been hella awkward that day. I was like, oh, this guy, is, he seems very yeah. awkward. Yeah, I'm like starting to remember. I think I had like borderline social anxiety that day or something. I'm sorry. No, it's cool. I mean, like, you know, no. I came, I was just like, okay, I don't know anybody. I'm like, I need to get drunk fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sammy you were, was you were there. there. Yeah, Sammy was there too. Well, that's like who I was clicked up with. But Sammy mm. knew most of everyone that was there too. Oh. I, I didn't know Sammy then either. Oh, you did it. Yeah. And then I remember I ran into you at the Pyeonghi Oh, you were, yeah. You were, like, you, were like, you were like scarfing down like chicken breast. Yeah. I was like… By himself? Yeah, at the Pyeonghi. Like, you know, usually you see people like ramen or yeah, something yeah. like at Kabe the ramen. counter. Mm-hmm. He had like the… Like the lock and lock. It was like marinated like chicken breast in there. I was like… I was like, wait, why is this guy here? Like, he brought his own food to the Pyeonghi oh. <laughs> I, like, I, like, I was like, wait, what the yeah, heck? You, you did that? I was either buying eggs or uh, sweet potato. I see, oh, I see. okay. Yeah, something I to go I with the chicken. See, I didn't see the other stuff. I just saw the luck. I was like, damn, he brought his own food to the. Oh, no, you know what? I was, I was, uh, I, uh, maybe I was on my way back from somewhere and I was probably like using their microwave or something. Oh, maybe, oh maybe, maybe, maybe. You were on a diet back then too. Yeah, oh, dude. Yeah, he yeah. he. It was like I just remember the chicken breast was like I don't know what it was like kind of like a red tint like it was yeah. marinated like yeah, yeah, kind of yeah. reddish. And I was just like, damn, this guy. I was like, he looks familiar. No, yeah. but I didn't. It didn't click where I saw him from. But I was like, he brought his own food to the peony <laughs> jump. All right. And then I remember he brings their own food to the yeah. peony jump. I was like, what the. F-? And then. I bought myself and I was like going out and it was like, oh hey, hey, hey. It was like, oh, we met at like Ashley. I was like, oh sh- that's where I saw him. Yeah, I was like, oh, yeah, yeah. But yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah, was well, my first impression. One thing I remember about Neil, he just says what's up to everyone. That's like a mm-hmm. big thing. I was really? like, oh wow. He just like says, goes and introduces himself and says what's up to everybody. I was like, mm-hmm. dang. Oh, no. did I introduce myself first? I don't remember. Yeah, I think you either we were introduced or you came up first. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. But I see that a lot happening with you. Like when we're out at parties or whatever. Like uh-huh. you're always like… You know… Mm, you know what I mean? Like very… No awkwardness. Just very forward. I was just oh, like, no, oh, wow. I'm what a great trait to have. I'm trying to not act awkward. <laughs> Instead I'm like… I don't know what to say. Yeah, what's up? What's up? <laughs> yeah. Oh you speak English. Where are you from? <laughs> <laughs> Where are you from? Well I first… Um, Came to dive through mm-hmm. Haiting. So when I first went, I was very impressed. I was like, this is legit because they had like 20 camera crew people. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They they had, like, the, yeah you know, yeah. sound system people. So I was like, whoa, I feel like I'm shooting for like a big, um, like, like a variety, like, yeah, program like a variety or show. So I was like, oh, this is cool. And then they were also linked up with like Facebook and stuff. So I was like, oh, this is legit. And then <laughs> <laughs> we had like unlimited, mom, I'm on TV. <laughs> unlimited like <laughs> coffee and. <laughs> Drinks and stuff like that. Oh yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Yeah, so I was like, I was happy to be there. 
I felt special being there. Yeah, no, Haiting was that was big. That was big though. Mm-hmm. Haiting was I'm sure not for you guys. I mean, it was probably big like a big headache for you guys, but yo, <laughs> one thing that kind of got me a little irritated was how many times we had to switch the sweatshirt. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. my god. <laughs> that, that was annoying. Mind I you, it was hot. It was in the middle of summer too. I was like, they couldn't it wasn't? No, it was winter. Why was it so hot? Maybe it's because I kept taking it <laughs> off. No, no, no. They, they had like the heater blast. Oh, okay, it, it, was, okay. it was very hot in there for sure. Yeah. But I remember I was like… They couldn't think of like something better than like… Maybe like a jersey like over yeah. like our… Or something. But I, I don't remember that. I was like… We gotta switch again. And I remember one time they made a switch. And then we came down and like… Oh wait, sorry. You have to switch again. Like we're doing like a different one. I was like… What the… God… <laughs> Nat. <laughs> <laughs> but um… Was hot. Yeah, but first impression though, I was I was like, oh, they're still like, um, I like it was like, I feel like they're still pretty new, mm-hmm. they're still getting everything together. But at the same time, I was like thankful because I didn't really have something where I could, because I did like English radio, but you know, I still gotta have a filter. I mean, I still kind of have a filter here, but way less than on radio. Yeah. yeah. But I was like, oh, I could be, um, the most. Me that I've ever been in front of camera, I feel like. That's true. So, um, I was like thankful. I was like, all right, I'm I'm sure they'll get everything together soon. Yeah, if, and um, they did. Yeah, a lot of people were looking forward to Hiking Season Two. Yeah, uh, they asked you to be on it. Would you be on it? Hell yeah! Um, but in the contract, I would put no <laughs> changing clothes. <laughs> No, but yeah, oh, I'd be down. I'd be down. It's like that you're was... the only one that doesn't yeah. change clothes. You guys didn't put that on your contract. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're stupid. You guys are dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you over there switching your hoodie again. It's are like, you what? sweating right now? <laughs> I'm chilling. <laughs> <laughs> like, what team are you on? I don't know. I'm not changing. <laughs> yeah, I was like fifth place out of six. I sucked. That's the day I realized. Wow, I freaking suck at games. Can we have you on the next season as well? Please. It's like one person so I don't have to worry rank. about. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, um, it is time to slowly start wrapping up. But um, let's just give a shout out to Get Real listeners. Um, we should give them a nickname. Oh. Mm. We should give them a nickname. Ooh, that would be a good yeah. one. Get um, Real. I mean, real. whoever's listening right now, go on Twitter. <laughs> what, what should the hashtag for the thing be? Oh, just do a hashtag. Get real nickname. Send in a bunch of lists and then Ooh. Diane will sort through and give us the top… Uh, <laughs> right? No? No? Okay, never mind. <laughs> okay, Extra no. work no, for no. me? No, no, thank you. <laughs> we, we should… In the near future, we'll come up with a few um, options. Yeah. And then we'll do the vote thingy on uh, Twitter. Twitter? Mm. Yeah. yeah. That yeah. works. Okay, we'll good. do that. Okay. Uh, and then we'll think Have of a name. nickname for our listeners. Yeah. But um, anyways, um, people who have been here from the beginning, people who are joining in now, thank you guys for listening. Thank you for all the support. Um, once again, we are the greatest podcast in the world, so you don't want to miss it. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, thank you guys so much. Thank you for showing us lots of love. Um, you guys want to add anything? Uh, I'm not a. I'm not good at expressing gratitude. <laughs> <laughs> I hope uh, we've been any type of help. Um, if you're going through any type of endeavor or difficult struggles in your life. Mm-hmm. Um, or just a moment of laughter, I guess. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like yeah. a little bit of stress relief. Oh, one thing that I really liked is that people said that they feel like they're part of a conversation oh, yeah. when they listen. Mm-hmm. You are. Like, yeah, yeah. So you technically are. Yeah. 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 I really like that about Get Real. We f- can love you. All right, there we go. With that, <laughs> no. What do you want to say? You have to. You didn't um, say anything. I just want to say thank you for sending your messages and like mm-hmm. the struggles that you're going through through mm. Discord well, and Discord. They're always open, so you guys can leave um, anything you guys want us to talk about at yes. any time, and for we sure. will try to apply that to the future episodes. Mm. Um, yeah, just thank you for giving us. Um, Topics. No, no. Topics, but also. <laughs> so you guys are the reason we can keep going. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Literally. Well, well, yeah. Technically, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. But uh, yeah. So if you guys wish to stay updated on the show, Instagram and Twitter uh, handles are at the Dive Studios. 
Full episodes will be up on youtube.com slash dive pods after the audio release. A few days after the audio release. And I don't think we've ever said our social media handle. Oh, yeah. What is, yeah, what is your… Uh, Instagram at Big Matthew, two T's and three W's. All right, there you go. Instagram and YouTube at Ashley B. Choi. All right, and then mine is at B2B Peniel, B T O B T O B P E N I E L. Oh, wait, hold on. Is there shit? No. No, no, no. Just no. B2B Peniel. Yeah. yeah. And uh, Twitter is Peniel Shin. That's all right. Anyways, once again, remember to subscribe and review this podcast. Good reviews only. Mm. And thank you, everyone, for listening. Thank you guys. 40th episode. You. See you guys in the fir- 41st episode. The fir- 41st. 41st episode. <laughs> in a wadi <laughs> Bye. Bye. Peace. Hey, did you like this video? If so, click the subscribe button. And make sure to turn on your notifications so you don't miss a single video. And listen to the entire audio episode on Spotify or Apple Podcasts.